Meghan's soon-to-be sister-in-law, Duchess Kate, is now speaking out about the engagement. William and I are absolutely thrilled. It's such exciting news. Um, it's a really happy time for any couple, and we wish them all the best. On the day after the huge announcement, British national newspapers welcomed the American princess with enthusiastic headlines. But a columnist for one magazine, The Spectator, is under fire for calling Meghan unsuitable because she is divorced from her first husband, actor-producer Trevor Engelson. Seventy years ago, Meghan Markle would have been the kind of woman the prince would have taken for a mistress, not a wife. Harry Potter author J.K. Rowling came to Meghan's defense, tweeting the hashtag Team Divorce, which triggered a blizzard of supportive tweets from the U.S. and Britain. Barack and Michelle Obama sent their congratulations, but more than 24 hours after the announcement, there has been no message of congratulations, congratulations from President Trump or First Lady Melania. Could the reason be this TV appearance by Meghan during last year's election campaign? As misogynistic as Trump is and so vocal about it. Right. But now Meghan and Harry are focused on next May's big day. Harry and Meghan at the moment are working out the logistics so that the public really can be a part of this wedding, but also in a sort of a bit more of a private setting.